Hey guys, and welcome back to Overlord Raising Hell. Last time we were in the Glittering Mine, and we're looking for money. And uh, I'm exploring these other areas that I haven't been to in the hopes that I can find a green spawner, which I think I might find down here because, well, slugs in the area looks green. Aha, there is a green spawner, yes. Good, because I only really want to spawn greens. Okay, and those other greens that are jumping on the slugs are still alive, by the way. So, yeah, there's that. Is that all money? It is money. Give me it. Thank you. All right. More slugs. I don't know where the hell you came from, but I'm going to kill you. Yeah. Kill that stupid slug. All right. You know, it makes me wonder why the minions don't just kind of go off on their own. I wonder why they even really need an overlord to command them because it seems like they're a pretty they are a pretty formidable fighting force even on their own all they gotta do is just jump on stuff it's kind of the same thing with Pikmin it's like why are the Pikmin why do they even need Olimar because he doesn't do anything he just tells them what to do once they learn what to do what do they need him for short answer is they don't because at the end of Pikmin 1, they if you if you get 100%, I think. It's like it shows them jumping on a big bulb orb and killing it or something. I don't remember. But yeah, I mean, it's it really seems like they could survive pretty easily without any outside help. Because, like, look at this. They're friggin' powerhouses. The green, like, it, really, the minions would be... All they need is just some general intelligence to just... Have a brown, go up and lure them, lure an enemy back to a pack of greens, and then <laughs> you win, basically. So, here we are. Are these guys really still jumping on slugs? They are still jumping on slugs! Oh my god, that's amazing. Alright, well, you guys have done your job. So I'm going to uh, close off the slug spawner. <laughs> Look at them go! God, the greens are the best. Okay. Welcome back. Okay. So, let's go ahead and get that. No. No. What are you What are you guys doing? Don't pull it from there. Or uh don't What are you What are you doing? I don't understand where why you're going this way. I guess I'll have them break this. Whoops. Didn't mean to kick you. I still don't like that. I wish you could only kick the jester. Oh, there we go. Oh, crap. I don't know how much money it was. Okay. Uh, 9,400. Uh, was there a second one? I believe there was. 9,400. Crap. I don't know what money I was at. Okay, well, I know I'm at 9,400. Oh. Okay, so it's worth 3,000 apiece. Oh, my God. Each card is 3,000 bucks. That's really good. And there's four of them. So you get 12,000 gold down here. I mean, just from the gold carts. Because there's all this other... All the other gold that you get. Oh my god, this place is awesome. So I'm gonna go back. Gonna find the other minions. Okay, they're despawning. That's fine. Uh, now I believe there was the green spawner back here, was it? No, no, it wasn't. It was over here, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, it was back here. Okay. I love that whole despawning thing. That's actually really helpful. That way they don't just get left all over the place. Okay. Alright. Here we go. And now we can head back. Sorry, I know this is taking a long time, but I, it's, it's my fault for leaving those gold carts before. That and losing so many minions to the crossbow dwarves. I hate those guys. Man. What I need to do against those guys is basically just tank the shots myself, save the minions, and, uh, you know, send them to kill them afterwards. Because they usually only get, like, one shot off before they die. Like that. Nothing in there. Sure is a lot of stuff here. Kind of weird that they just have, like, tables and chairs in a mine. You'd think that it'd be like, oh, well, it's a mine. You're not supposed to sit down and work. I mean, uh, <laughs> you're not supposed to sit down and be lazy. You're supposed to work 100% of the time. Here we go. Go down there and get some stuff. Anything else? A whole bunch of cash. Uh, I don't think there's anything else down there. Okay. Oh, wait, no, I see a bag. Take a bag of money right there. 
don't I? Aha! Ding! There we go. Okay, now that's done. Break that slug thing. You know, why were the dwarves having problems with the slugs if literally all they have to do is just push something over where they come from? Okay. Now. Blessings be upon you. We must find the others. Yeah, yeah, get out of here with you and your weird voice. Okay, so is there anything in here? No. Okay, oh, no, there's barrels. Aha, this is going to have gold in it. Yep, I knew it. Because every other barrel in here had gold in it. Yay. Plenty of money. God, I've made like 3,000 gold on nothing but the gold in the area, like in the barrels and the boxes and stuff. That's crazy. Wow, that's a big mana potion. Wow, that healed a full bar of mana. That's great. Okay, is there anything down there? Doesn't look like it. Yeah, there's nothing. Okay, oh, get that. Somebody get that. No? Okay. I think that's what getting the minion equipment does. It makes it so that the minions just always have, like, full full equipment. So, like, they're not, they're not picking up any weapons. They're not picking up any armor. Even though they normally do pick up armor. Everyone likes gold, sire. But this king, Goldo, seems obsessed with it. <sighs> There's nothing to buy around here. I wonder what he's doing with it. Yeah, I know. I was just saying that myself. Okay, so this is where... Yeah, this is the opening of the mine. Okay. Oh, boxes. Is there any gold in there? Uh-huh. There is gold in there. There's gold in them, our boxes. Okay. So, you guys continue carrying the gold cart. At these elves would hurry their asses up. Man. Okay. So at least we're on the way out. And, you know, this place really reminds me of that area in Star Fox Adventures. Uh, oh, uh, what was that place? It was the first area you go to. It's like where the mammoths are. Oh, uh, it was a mine. It was another mine. That's why it's making me think of it. Crap, I don't remember the name of it. Like, Sharp Tooth, Sharp, Sharp Tooth Mines or something? I don't remember. Okay, so, another 3,000. Yay! Your mistress is delighted. Wow, that's hilarious. It actually says your mistress is delighted. That's awesome. Be careful with corruption spells. I make no distinction. I need to do a playthrough of this game where I'm corrupted. Like, where I kill everybody. I've never done that. I probably should at some point, because I've never done it before. Not even in the second game. I'm not going to do it when I play the second game. I'm going to do the, uh... You know, the normal way, the way I always do it, but yeah. At some point, I should probably do a corruption playthrough where I just kill everybody. Okay. So were there more trapped elves? They said, oh, we need to find the others! But I wonder if there's more trapped elves in other areas. Probably. Okay. So, here we are, back where we started. Now, I believe, also, that the next smelter is here in the Dwarf Lands. So, that's another reason why you want to come here. So, you can get the new, the, the highest level smelter. So, you can get the highest level armor and such. Such a proud race. Reduced to servitude. <laughs> Sometimes even gods have a sense of humor. Don't you mean Humour? <sighs> Greens! Take care of them. All right. Destroy their tables! Oh, I can't. Wow. Oh, they are picking stuff up! Yeah, yeah, they are picking stuff up. Interesting. I didn't know that. I thought they weren't. I thought they weren't picking stuff up. But apparently they are. Okay. Now let's go ahead. Do that. Haha! -ha! Have some slugs, you bastards! Hehe. <laughs> Alright. So now I can just what? The hell? Ugh. Those pipes channel beer straight from the brewery. It's potent stuff. How do you know? Like minions, dwarves are never more ferocious than when they've had a drink. So watch out, sire. 
Okay. Oh no, they got exploded by something. I don't even know what. Oh my god, that dwarf is drunk and he's like killing everything. Jeez. Alright, drunk minions, go! Destroy our enemies and then piss on their corpses or something. I don't know. I see a crossbow, man. No. Get out of here. Uh oh, drunk dwarf. There, that's better. Jeez, I lost a lot of minions. Okay, let's go ahead and push that thing back. Much better. Whoops, didn't mean to kick you. Okay, so that's that. That wasn't so bad. Well, I mean, could have gone better, but it's okay. Ooh, what's that? Oh, it's a new minion thingy. Ah, a new minion spell. Sweet. I think that's the highest level. I think the highest is only three. So, yeah. Come on, get on out of there. There we go. That's better. Okay. Got so much treasure here. Why do they just have gold just sitting around out here? We got chests filled with crap. And, yeah, it doesn't seem like this is people's money because they're not spending it on anything. What the? Oh, that's the, the pan or whatever that thing is. Okay. So, uh, is there any more gold? Ah, there is. And I think what I might do is actually head back to the tower and buy the rest of the stuff, actually. Oop. Because from here on out, there's there's always going to be more money to get because there's always chests and stuff like that. But once I get that done, then I can just worry about uh, having enough money to buy the highest level armor and weapons. That will be nice. And I'm going to build my uh, mace a little bit differently. And same with my armor. I'm not going to even bother with bonus health or bonus mana or whatever. I'm going to focus entirely on, like, straight damage and, uh, straight damage, straight defense. Stop pissing all over my leg. Um, straight damage, straight defense, and straight health regeneration. Because, oh my god, that's helpful. Okay, so where did they go with that friggin' minion spell? They are taking forever. Did they die on the way? I sure hope not. Or are they just going really slow? Oh no, I called them back. Crap. Where is it? Um, <laughs> I guess it's just somewhere back here. Okay, uh, where is it? Man. Did I call him back like half a... Oh my god, I did! I called him back when it was like half a foot away from the frigging portal. Great. Blech. Hate it when that happens. The Legion of Honor spell will boost the defense and attack of your minions. She will also make sure they only attack your enemies and not just, well, you know, everyone and everything. Yeah, that helps. Okay, so apparently I lost five somewhere, or I just couldn't find five. So we're going to go back, and I'm going to buy some stuff for my woman, because... Ugh. Sorry, I was just stretching there. Um, I'm going to buy some stuff for my woman, because I am a good... I'm a good man. A man? Not a man. A man? So yeah. <sighs> Come on. Oh, these loading screens are awful. Especially when you're loading the tower. It seems weird that it takes so long to load just the tower. Salutations! Bye now. I could really go for those other health upgrades, though. That'd be nice. Okay, now I want to check my treasure chamber, because last time I had less than a thousand. This is the most money I've ever had, so let's see. Yeah, that's much better. Look at that. That, oh my god. Yes. Okay, so... Go ahead and uh, waste all this money now. <laughs> God. Okay. So, uh, buttress fang spikes. I prefer those. Those look way cooler. I uh, already got that. Oh, I know. Dogs of Hell statues. Chandelier. Oh, golden demon. Oh, my God. Uh, yes. Okay, chandeliers. Dog romantic fool. Okay, now. Okay, no, not yet. Uh. 
Golden demon statues. Hell yes. An excellent choice, darling. Yeah, I know, right? God. So friggin' awesome. Okay, dogs of hell. I've always wanted one of those. Well, we have two now. Golden dog. Oh, yes. What's the fun in having gold if you don't spend it? Oh my god, that looks so cool. Okay. Um, ooh, a black carpet. I hope you don't expect me to clean that. <laughs> God, so lazy. Black marble walkway? Uh, I don't like that, actually. It doesn't look as good. Obsidian spikes. An excellent choice, darling. Even though I probably won't be able to see those, but whatever. A uh, skull fireball? I've always wanted one of those. Oh, wait, no. Did I go back? Ah, grand. Oh, yes. An excellent choice, darling. Hell yes. Oh, my God. I am wasting a lot of money. Uh, buttress... Uh, let's go for the buttress fang spikes. Now, what good is that to me? Well, it looks cool. Shut up. Uh, fang top. Now, don't forget to buy a few things for your mistress. I already did. What are you talking about? Okay. Greater fa Ooh! I don't care what they say. What you look like on the outside is everything, Lord. Huh? <laughs> Uh, red minion equipment. Okay, I cannot buy that. So that's basically everything except for the black marble walkway, and I don't like that. Mistress Velvet requests the pleasure of your company in your private quarters, sire. Oh, she does, does she? And, well, at least I still have a little bit of money. So, basically, when you buy absolutely every item... My sister's the kind of person that always has a piece of string or a bandage or sensible shoes. She's... what's the word? Boring. <laughs> Um, anyway, when you buy everything for this area, like when you buy all the items for your private chambers, you are, uh, your mistress demands your attention for a little bit. So, yeah, we're gonna go see what's up. What's up, woman? Master! <laughs> Let me see! Stop pushing! There you are, my darling. Now, the first thing we have to do is get you out of that heavy armor. Nice! <laughs> oh, sire! Oh my god! <laughs> well, that was a surprise. I think you're undercompensating, Master. <laughs> is that even a thing? Well, for me it is! <laughs> Sorry. Oh, God, that was really loud. Sorry. I'll have to turn that one down. Jeez. Okay, so that is what happens when you buy every single thing in the tower for your private chambers. You don't have to do that, but you can. Wait a minute. Purger of the perverted paladin. Is he gonna say anything about that? Lord of lust and lechery. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> uh, all right. Anyway, <laughs> so now we're gonna go back to the Golden Hills because that's actually where we need to go. So, um, now when you when you get uh, velvet, I believe that is basically just like a straight, like that. It, there's not even. Um, like, it's not even an undertone. That's basically just a sex scene right there. And I'm pretty sure when you do, when you get Rose, it's kind of, it's it's funny because it's like, um, since she's not just like a gigantic slut, uh, I'm pretty sure that when you get Rose and when you buy everything, she calls you to your chambers and it turns out that it's like a planning meeting. Like, she actually pulls up like a big map of the area and, and it's like, the minions are listening. It's funny because she uses like a lot of suggestive words, but it's not sex, not at all. It is actually like a planning thing. So she's like, "Oh, how are you going to attack them?" You know, and the minions don't hear that. And she says like they manage to hear, "Oh, pincer maneuver." And it's like <laughs> it's really funny because the minions think it's sex, but it's not. But with Velvet, it's just straight up sex. Which is the reason why I picked her, because, again, totally shallow, lonely, single, well, she's the perfect choice. Anyway, um, oh, uh, what am I doing? 
uh, we need to go back and we need to actually progress because now that the mine is done and all the stuff of the Dark Tower is done, uh, now I can save my money for weapons and armor, which is the best thing to get. Okay. Although there's technically only three things I need to... Oh, whoa. He is no dwarf. You don't know that. Out. Let us out! Quick, before the guards return! We are a disgrace to our race. We should have died fighting. Let me die with dignity, stranger. Please, we still have some strength left. Rescue, stranger. Whoa, whoa, where did they all come from? Oh, they came from there. Okay. So, was that just to free some elves, I guess? Because I didn't actually get anything for that. Whatever. Anyway. So you can free some elves there. Get out of the way! Or I'll kill you! <laughs> okay. So, uh, where are we going? Man, if I could just see the friggin' mini-map. Or, like, if I could see a, a large map, that would be great. So, does this lead anywhere? It leads there. Uh... It doesn't look like it actually does lead anywhere. Let's see. Oh, come on. Why are these back? And I did cover that thing, so I wonder why the slugs are back. Protect the elves, I guess. Even though I don't really care. They can die for all I care. Um, what is that? Oh, they're green bugs for some reason. Okay. Hey, a puff beetle. Kill it. Alright, get some green life force. Of course, green life force is not a problem. I can just get it in the dungeon whenever I need to. And that's probably what I'm going to do. Like, off screen. Oh, hey, look, this chest respawned. I guess chests respawn every time you leave an area? Oh, wow, he just killed the elves. Good job. They can't even fight a single damn bug. That's pretty sad. You are a disgrace to your race. You can't even handle a bug. My god. I get that it's kind of a big bug, but dude. You guys are bitches. Come on. Okay, quit drinking. Let's go. Okay, so this is not where I need to... Oh, wait a minute. There's barrels here. There might be gold in there. And I want gold. Is there anything? Aha! There was gold. Mm-hmm. Knew it. Okay, so now where the hell am I going? I don't even know. Oh, you know what? I need to end it off. So, uh, in this part, we got laid. Next time, we are not going to get laid. So, yeah. See you then.